Welcome to the very first video of World of Warcraft Classic Hardcore. My goodness. We're going to start off with a brand new character over here. And uh, I think we're going to play Rogue. Or Hunter. Hmm. 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 Nah, we'll play, we'll play Rogue. We'll play Rogue, dude. Um, let's uh, randomize a few times. So we get something nice. She looks nice. I'll tap that. I mean, I, I, I'd play that. Uh, let's play Master. Aww. Can you put caps? We can't put ER at the end there, so... Two letters too short. Yeah, we'll make this character. I agree. You can see all my characters over here. I'm still so sad about this, bro. You know, I paid someone, I can't remember how much it was, 150 gold or something, to help me unlock this weapon. I think I killed like three things and then I died after that. Uh, I was running a bit too close to the Alliance uh, entrance and I got slapped by one shot by the enemy guard. That just sucks so much. For 10,000 years, the immortal Night Elves cultivated a druidic society within the shadowed recesses of Ashenvale Forest. Yet recently, the catastrophic invasion of the Burning Legion shattered the tranquility of their ancient civilization. Led by the arc druid Malfurion Stormrage and the priestess Tyranda Whisperwind, the mighty Night Elves rose to challenge the demonic onslaught. Though victorious, the Night Elves were forced to sacrifice their cherished immortality and watch their beloved forests burn. Seeking to regain their immortality, a number of wayward druids conspired to plant a special tree that would link their spirits to the eternal world. Despite Malfurion's warnings that nature would never bless such a selfish act, the druids planted the great tree Teldrassil off the stormy coasts of northern Kalimdor. Within the twilight boughs of the colossal tree, the wondrous city of Darnassus took root. However, the great tree was not consecrated with nature's blessing and soon fell prey to the corruption of the Burning Legion. Now the wildlife and even the limbs of the great tree itself are tainted by a growing darkness. As one of the few Night Elves still left in the world, it is your sworn duty to defend Darnassus and the wild children of nature against the Legion's encroaching corruption. All right. Greeting. Ah, the beauty of Shadow Glen never ceases to delight my senses. Greetings, adventurer. I am Conservator Ilthalane. My purpose in Shadowglen is to ensure that the balance of nature is maintained. The spring rains were particularly heavy this year, causing some of the forest's beasts to flourish, while others suffered. Unfortunately, the Nightsaber and Thistlebore populations grew too large. Shadowglen can only produce so much food for the beasts. Journey forth, young adventurer and thin the boar and saber population so that nature's harmony will be preserved. Not enough energy. Then get enough energy, girl. Enough energy. Okay, so we're using quite a bit of add-ons. Uh, as you can see, we have Plater add-on. Uh, we also have a DPS meter. Um, ooh, we've got a different coat. We have quite a few add-ons. Uh, we have Questy. That will also help us with quests. Um, what else is there that's like needed? We also have GSE installed. What was that noise? Too 
Oh, we got a new bracer. Nice. Not a bad. We also have another add-on called Better Bags. So we'll be using these add-ons. Until we find something better. I know there's a better UI also. Uh, that I loved. Uh, what was it? Alf UI? It was pretty nice. Maybe we'll get into that again. But for now, I think uh, this UI is fine. This UI is actually a decent so far. And I did play I did play a hunt uh, sorry a rogue a little bit. Nothing too special. You just farm a bit also. I think farming is a waste of time. Uh, we'll grab this quest, just to get it out of my face. I don't have enough energy. It's like, uh, Questy is showing this icon all the time, that there's a quest close by. Greetings, young adventurer. Can you offer me aid? I have a package of herbs that I must deliver to the town of Dolinar, but I still have business with the druids of Shadowglen and cannot yet leave. Can you deliver this package for me? It must be sent to Innkeeper Keldon at the Dolinar Inn. It lies along the road to the south. So we have a quest, hand and quest already deep down. But that's higher level stuff there. Not enough energy. Work complete. Nice. Our first quest is done. Uh, we can grab these quests as well. Uh, let's just hand in this quest first. And then it might lead us into the building. You performed your duties well, adventurer. Thank you. May the thinning the younger population of creatures here in Shadow Glen was a good start, adventurer. But there is still work to be done. The resources of the forest will be depleted too quickly if the problem is not addressed. Killing nature's beasts is a necessary evil for the good of all who share the land. Venture into the forest and slay mangy night sabers and thistle boars in the name of balance. This sigil was given to me by a messenger from our rogue trainer, Frahun. It seems Frahun would have words with you when you have a moment. Read it and bring it to him afterwards. Thank goodness you are here, adventurer. Strange news has traveled to me through the whisperings of the forest spirits. The mysterious woodland protector, Tarendrella, has returned to Shadow Glen. The Dryad's presence has not been felt in the forests of Kalimdor in years. Something is surely amiss if she has journeyed back to this land. Seek out Tarendrella and see what business she tends to in our grove. One of the sentinels reported seeing her to the southwest of Aldrasa. A friend of mine named Ivorin usually visits me at the same time every day. The strange thing is that he hasn't been by today at all. He's several hours late, in fact. I admit I am a little worried, adventurer. Ivorin spends a lot of time over by the cave to the north, and I'm sure you know how dangerous it is there. Spiders everywhere. If you happen to be going that way, though, will you keep an eye out for him? Sure thing, girl. Ah, the great outdoors. Okay, we could just do this quest then. Gotta slap some imps. At level two. I can't believe I'm playing WoW again, dude. This is absolutely insane.
But yeah, we're we are a variety channel, so gotta play everything. This thing is level three, bro. I don't have we got another back there. Another Bracer. So at level 10 we actually get our skill, skill tree, I think. And then every level we can actually uh, get some skills. I'm not, I'm not too sure what we're gonna play yet because we'll have to wait and see, obviously. But I want to get deal wheeled as soon as we can. Also, I think human rogue is most probably better. Because they have more skill in, in certain weapons, like swords, I think. Swords and maces. But I have dodge chance. Uh, way higher dodge chance with a night elf, so... Work complete. Uh, okay. We leveled up again. Oh, they're spawning on top of you. That's gonna be fun later. That's gonna be very fun later. What is nature's call? Always take leather. So we got new panties. We've quite the few quests already. I came to Shadow Glen to observe the webwood spiders that dwell in the Shadow Thread Cave. They are cousin to a much smaller variety of spider. I believe the World Tree has had a profound effect on them, and I would like specimens to study to confirm this. First, I would like some of their venom. Gather webwood venom sacs from the spiders in and around the Shadow Thread Cave to the north. I can then examine them for similarities with their smaller cousin's venom. We have a quest hand in here, and I, I'm not too sure if it's at the top of this place. All I know is that... If it's not up here, then it's quite a waste of time. <laughs> and by the way... I think the number one death for most people, now, now it shows down. The number one death for most people is fall damage. So it's not a top here. So it's inside this building somewhere. Maybe it's uh, deeper in. Yeah, it has to be deeper in. It's maybe where our trainer is. I mean, I don't know where it is, though. Uh, Armory, Weaponsmith. It might actually be b worth buying a better weapon. Ishno. Greetings, young rogue. What do you seek? Until then, know that our kind are needed more than ever in this tenuous time. Peace with the other races can fail at any moment, and there is much talk about members of the Horde looking to sow even greater seeds of distrust. Remember that. As you gain in power and feel more prepared, come back to me here and I will see about getting you some training. It's important that you know how to handle your weapon of choice, among other things.
Uh, let's buy the new weapon. Bro, it's not worth. Peace be with you. I need to get another add-on. Uh, let's see your macro. Um, I should have... I should have a good uh, macro add-on in the past. I think when you're inverse, sorry, when you're in combat, you go inverse. Sorry, when you're out of combat, you go inverse. And when you're in combat, it's Sinus Strike. But I think all those icons will display for that macro at, uh, as soon as we have um, enough levels, I would say. For now, I actually feel pretty strong and confident. I mean, we have zero issues so far killing anything. But obviously the game becomes extremely harder later. Level 4, we don't have to kill it, but... Found a shield. We have eight bag slots left. And we're not even at the poison area yet. So we should just do this quest and ha like run back, I think. Also, I don't know why this invest icon is here. I don't know what it is. Or... Is it part of this? It's not part of this. I also think I want to put it a little bit lower. I mean, if I can get that inverse icon to actually be here, that would be fine. Bro, there's so many add-ons I can think of that we should get still. Yeah, I don't think we should go in there yet. Let's run back, hand in this quest. Not ready yet. I don't have enough energy. I need to get closer. Dude, 
dude, this game feels so quiet. All you hear is your footsteps running around. It must be questy, right? I mean, I, I'll, I'm fine with it as long as I can move it, you know? I don't have a target. I am you have proven your dedication to nature well, adventurer. A young adventurer like yourself has a promising future. Are you sure about that? Goodness. Yeah, there's another add-on we need to get. I forgot the name. Hello. Let me get those add-ons quickly. Okay, I got some changes done. I still don't know what the heck the style thing is, to be honest. Um, all I can say is it's pretty annoying. <laughs> But we'll just leave it there for now. I think on our next video we'll... Uh, we'll get something, like a UI. A UI install would be good, I would say. I'm out of range. Okay, as a rogue, we need to turn that off. Options, combat. Something about targeting. Okay. So now it shouldn't auto-target stuff. At all. Or I could just tell it to auto-target stuff. <laughs> Which I most probably will. One out of ten. I think we should just run in. Get our ass into the cave. What level are these guys already? Level 6. It's dudes I played with uh, before. I, I played another version of WoW. Uh, I can't remember the name of it though. Season of Discovery, I think is what it's called. Um, with a bunch of people. And those, like those bunch of people also. How did you know I was here? <sighs> I was bitten very badly by a spider named Githius the Vile while exploring the spider cave very close to here. I am sure I have been seriously poisoned. You must help me. 
Please tell Dirania Silvershine. She will be able to help me. Hurry. I'm so dizzy. Okay. So, it seems like we have to run back first. I don't want to use my Hearthstone here. Don't use my Hearthstone here because I want to use it once we get into the cave. So I'll just have to run back for now. Nah, dude, I honestly think I need to get a, a UI. It is too far away. Now it shows upgrades. That's an upgrade for our chest. <laughs> let's let's tell them. <laughs> oh dear, I was wondering why I hadn't seen Ivaran yet today, and I've always warned him about those spiders. We may be able to help Ivran, as I know of an antidote that should help with the poison. It requires some ingredients, though, before I can make it. I'll need hyacinth mushrooms. You can find these growing under trees, or you may collect them from the Grell south of here. They seem to have taken a liking to them. I'll also need moon petal lilies, which only grow around watery pools. The last ingredient may prove the most difficult. From the very spiders that poisoned Ivorin, collect webwood ichor. See, that's why we had to run back, because that quest will lead then into the, the cave. Human priest. What's the other guy? Human paladin. His icons on our screen is kind of annoying, but it's very useful. Where's the mushrooms at, my buddy? I also feel like we can... Um... Go into music. Enable sound. Loop music. It's like, dude, it's so quiet sometimes. We have an item. Moon petal lily. This is probably in this water right here.
It's annoying that the bag is so big, dude. Here we go. Give me them planties, bro. We only have three bags sp uh, space available. That is not good. It's okay, stuff around here is anyway worth copper, so doesn't really matter too much. Still need one mushroom as well. We need to get that from quest to removed. It's gonna become annoying when you're in party with people. So we're complete. We just have to go back now. Not uh, we also need to go sell. Is there a way to like make the bag smaller? Goodness. Oh, that looks nice. gathered these ingredients so quickly in just a moment i will have the antidote prepared the antidote is ready adventurer please see that ivorin drinks it there is something that you should know the antidote it will only remain viable for five minutes you must get it to him in time speed be with you adventurer what brings you here it doesn't auto sell junk I installed an add-on that will auto-sell junk, so this still doesn't work. Okay, let's see now. There we go. Dude, can I not get it to spam me? Okay, I also saw that we have 53 seconds to get there. We must probably will have to abandon the quest. The antidote is ready, adventurer. Please see that Ivorin drinks it. There is something that you should know. The antidote. It will only remain viable for five minutes. You must get it to him in time. Speed be with you, adventurer. We got this now. So that we can make the anchor point bottom right. So that we can put it like this. And no matter what we loot. Then I think also audio. 
Oh, wow. Okay. Figured that out by mistake. Can I ask what is this adventurer? Oh, I knew Durania would be able to help me. I'm always getting into trouble and Durania, well, she always manages to help me out of it. I'm feeling much better, but I think I will sit here for a while longer until I feel completely better. Well, that and I was hoping you would clear a path for me through those vicious webwood spiders. Okay, so now we're just gonna kill a few. Hopefully we can get back here before they're spawned. That would be great. Because I don't think we have to, the quest to get inside here yet. But we have no quest to hand in either. So yeah, let's see. Professions will take first aid. Most probably cooking. I don't have first aid cooking. Uh skinning and leather working. Not enough energy. Work complete. I think that's will that will be our focus here. Could be good. And you could also use the skinning knife as an offhand for a little bit. <laughs> But I think we get our off hand at level 10. Oh, it's click. Dude, so many add-ons has changed since last I, I played. Thank you, adventurer. When I return to Darnassus, I will compare the venom within these sacks with the venom of other spiders. It is my belief that it will have properties linked to the recent growth of our new world tree. Now that I have the spider's venom, I'd like some live specimens to study. Unfortunately, capturing a living giant spider is more than I can ask of you, young adventurer. And a giant spider is more than I could handle myself. But if you can find an unhatched egg, then delivering specimens will be much easier. And I can then arrange for the unhatched spiders to be contained. There must be a nest deep in the Shadow Thread Cave. Please, search for an egg in the nest and return it to me. Yes, sir. I will do that. Music is maybe a tiny tad too loud. It needs to be background music, not foreground, like, struggle to hear the quests. Okay, the best thing to do when there's red health bars is just kill everything or stealth your way through. The problem, though, uh, our stealth is pretty bad. I most probably won't play sub subtlety. Most probably will play combat, I think. Whatever gives us faster... Um, What do we call it? Faster energy regeneration. And higher crit could also be very useful. Not I don't have 
enough energy. Not enough energy. Here we have to buy throwables. There's the big daddy spider. But we can't get there. Oh, we got a small bag. I don't have enough energy. Those small bags are so useful early. Not cool, man. Yeah, I love the speed we're actually killing stuff at the moment. I think Warrior would have been slower. I think, uh... I think all classes would be slower. And what the, the pace we're going at. Here we go, Big Daddy. Try to poison us immediately. So yeah, we'll just hoth out of here. Perfect. Dude. The anchor point still doesn't work. Let's try bottom left. This egg and the venom transported to Darnassus, then return there when my studies are done here. I expect to find out a great deal from these specimens, adventurer. You have been a great help to me. Adventurer, is it? I heard that Teneron has been asking for you. You'll find him in the highest room atop Aldrasil. We may live long lives, but it's best you not keep him waiting too long. Yes. Whatever you say. <laughs> Dude, I'm honestly scared about this, you know, like raiding or dungeoning with people. Like you could die because just the, you know, the tank lost aggro or something like that. It can be so scary. Ah, adventurer. I was hoping you'd be prompt in answering my summons. I have an important task that I would like you to perform. It is time for you to set out to seek your destiny, adventurer. But before you are ready to set out into the world beyond our enchanted forests, there is much you must learn about our recent history. Much has changed with our people since the Battle of Mount Hyjal. Nordrassil lies a pale shadow of what it once was, its power used to defeat Archimonde and drive back the Burning Legion. There is a task you must perform. Go to the Moonwell north of Aldrassil and return me a file of its water. I need to get closer. Yeah. 
Yes, sir. Mine crystal doesn't work. Work complete. Okay, I guess now we have to run all the way up there again, if I'm not mistaken. We'll hand him back the quest. We also need to go to the trainer just to double check what we can train. Uh, there was another add-on that I used also back in the day. Uh, when I actually played Season of Discovery on release. Um, it's an add-on that shows what level you can learn stuff. And with that add-on, it actually helps you to to see if it's worth to go to the trainer at all. Or wh which level you want to go to the trainer. Like a Sinister Strike upgrade could be insane, right? But I think a UI, of like a flat UI also would be really good. Because this, this just doesn't look okay. <laughs> Peace. So you have heard the first part of the aftermath of the Battle of Mount Hyjal. There is much more to be told, and the task you have begun here will continue through the rest of your journey through Teldrassil, and into Darnassus. While there is more I could speak to you of the Moon Wells and of Teldrassil, I must send you along. Corythrus Moon Rage will be expecting you. I have poured the vial of water you brought to me into this vessel to bring to him. Seek out Corythrus. You will find him at the Moon Well in Dolinar. Follow the road south from Aldrasil, out of Shadowglen and continue to follow the cobblestones as the road turns west. Mind you stay on the road, though, adventurer. There are dangerous beasts in the forests of late. We've got backstab and pickpocket. Farewell. Greetings. We don't need two different foods. Good luck. What brings you? I do not see the warrior spirit within you, child. I have no teachings which would benefit our adventurers such as yourself. Greetings, young rogue. What do you seek? So you see, Sinister Upgrade is at level 6, which is extremely useful. I'm going to just minimize while I run, so the music would stop. Let's see, uh, audio. Sounds in background. I just want to... Just Google another add-on. What did I want to Google? Um, now I completely... Oh, yeah. So, let me see her. Should be this one. So that's another add-on, I would say. And then this vendor thing. Let's see her options.
We have a quest here. Settings. Chat output. Yeah, destroy, please. Now what? I don't know what now. You tell me, buddy. Level 6 enemies actually hit really hard. See, this is where humans become very strong. They have increased spurt, which is just uh, healing over time. Out of combat healing. Not enough. Okay, leveled. We need the owls now. Let's just go this way. Owls and cats. So those were the spiders. There's the owls. So yeah, we're level 6 now, so we can get this Sinister Upgrade. If we go train. By the way, I think these, like some of these cats uh, can go inverse. If I'm not mistaken. Got a guild invite. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. Uh, yeah. A random guild invited me, so... I'd rather be in the same guild as the, the people I'm gonna play with. Should we just grab all the quests here? Also try and find the, the trainer. Are you heading to the south, to Lake al Ameth? If so, then I have a task I might ask of you. My colleague Denelin has a camp along the eastern end of the lake where he is studying and experimenting on the plant life of Teldrassil. He requested a package of rare earths from Darnassus, and it was late, only recently arriving here in Dolinar. Can you take the package to him? A troubling breeze blows through the forest. Gairolus Talvathrin serves as great warden to the hibernating druids of the Talon in the Ban Ethel Barrow Den. 
His duty as the chosen protector of the sleeping is to ensure their safety so that their pact with Isera remains fulfilled. But word from Garolas is now delayed and I grow nervous. Travel east to Starbreeze Village and bring back a report from Garolas so that I can put my worries to rest, knowing my dreaming brethren slumber safely. I was once given an emerald dreamcatcher from Garolas Talbethan, the warden of the druids in the Ban Ethil Barrow Den. This powerful amulet is able to siphon energy from the emerald dream, bestowing luck upon those who carry it. Sadly, I have not been able to retrieve it from my dresser in Starbreeze Village. Although Starbreeze was once a tranquil place, it has now succumbed to the corruption of the Furbog that reside there. Perhaps you would be willing to recover my Dreamcatcher, Adventurer. I must warn you, Adventurer. This matter must stay between us. The Satyr are enough of an embarrassment to us already, and this one is much too close to home. He is called Lord Melanus. He resides in the nearby cave of Fell Rock, where he has gathered a large group of Grell warriors. His heart is black as night, and he plots something most foul. You must find him within his nearby cave just to the north of here, and bring me his head. Ah, yes, the delivery of herbs from Shadowglen. It is a shame Porthanius could not bring it himself, for we have much to discuss, he and I. But I'm glad to get the herbs nonetheless, and I'm glad you came. While you are here, please, rest yourself. Heroes must keep their strength and spirits high, and must find rest and solace whenever they may. For to neglect one's peace of body and mind is a sure path to failure. So, rest. Ah, I see. You were sent by Teneron. Well then, it would seem we have much to talk about, much to do, and little time to do it in. I think we'd best get started. First, let me tell you more of the task you must complete. The druids in Darnassus use the water of the moon wells of Teldrassil and their moon well must be replenished from time to time. Using these specially crafted files, you can collect the water of the moon wells. Take this vessel to the moon well outside of Star Breeze Village to the east and fill it with some of its waters, then return to me. When you have completed your task, I shall continue the story where Teneron left off. Long ago, the night elves were called the Kaldore, a name that means children of the stars. Learning of the past is an important step in your path as an adventurer, adventurer. So listen well to what I have to tell you. The Kaldore have always taken much pride in their harmonious relationship with nature. This means that we only take from nature what is necessary and that we return in kind. This balance has afforded us much, adventurer. Go out and collect seven small spider legs, but no more than that. So we gotta kill more spiders, clearly. Uh, it sucks that we can't learn skinning from here. They're like, now my buddy. So now we have upgraded Sinister Strike. So I also checked at level 10 is when we get deal building. That is uh, way stronger. It's a pretty big buff that we need. Work complete. A rare tracker that could be a rare close by. Energy. 
another bomb by it's a dust. So I think these guys they, they have a chance to drop uh silk. So you should always be careful when there's someone running out of a place. Dude, this fucking bag is annoying the shit out of me. Because he could have killed enemies and they might spawn on top of you. Let's see our professions. First aid. Wow. Thank the forest spirits you are here. I knew a three dust would sense trouble and send help. The Gnarlpine tribe has been corrupted. The once peaceful Furbogs have turned against the protectors of the forest. They ambushed me as I left for the Banathil Barrow Den and proceeded to pillage Starbreeze Village. Ursong, the Mauler, their chieftain, is using the evil powers of the Fell Moss to drive them mad. I'm too wounded to return to Athridas to bring him this grave news. The task is left to you, young adventurer. We can only hope that the deranged Gnarlpines have not made it to Banathil yet. This guy killed all the owls here. Okay, that's not cool. We just level to eight. I'm a cutie pie? Are you that can't be that can't be that it can't be him. Right. Should I quickly go on Twitch? Let me see. Yeah, he's not live right now. And I know for a fact he's playing a lot of teamfight tactics. Never really saw him play WoW, ever. Wait, there's another well that we have to go to. Work complete. Oh man. Emerald Dreamcatcher, so we need to go get there. So there, there where the flag is, that's where I'm going to train skinning and leatherworking. So it looks like we need to go deep in. Some bags around us. Oh, it's more spider legs. Complete. Don't have enough energy. 
Need two more. Never a bad idea to farm some cloth. You want to go hand in that quest as well. One more leg, dude. Even though a spider has 17 legs, you know, we only get one egg when we kill sometimes. So where where's the other legs, dude? What happened to them? The seven leg... <laughs> seven legs collected should be like two spiders that you kill. Maximum. But unless you play World of Warcraft, you'll be 20 spiders for, th for seven legs. Work complete. That's what I'm talking about. You again? Yeah, me again. It's a pretty decent item. Physical damage uh, caused by the target reduced by five. Is that even worth talking about, dude? It's so little. Like your PP. Got an, another level one. The Council of the Forest has news that you aided Zen Foulhoof. The satyr is an enemy of the forest. As a person, you should know better than to defile the forest by killing nature's creatures. You must redeem yourself in the eyes of the Council if you wish to remain a friend of Teldrasso. Teach Foulhoof a lesson and you shall be redeemed. Fell cones are corrupted seeds that fall from the trees. They billow with green smoke. Give some to Falhu. He'll think you have brought him a harmless snack. By the stars, this is quite disturbing indeed. Gnarl pine invaders were seen ravaging the Banethil Barrow Den to the west. The slumbering druids will be trapped in the Emerald Dream for eternity, unaware of their fate, unless we help. The delicate hibernation ritual cannot be broken without the relics of wakening. Journey to the den and retrieve the Ravenclaw talisman, black feather quill, sapphire of sky, and rune of nesting. The druids store them in sacred chests. Return them to me, and I will prepare the awakening ritual. My emerald dream catcher is of great importance to me. It is a gift only given to few. Thank you for returning it, adventurer. The emerald. It is missing. My Dreamcatcher has been damaged. There is a band of Gnarlpine mystics located to the north of Starbreeze. I have heard reports that their leader, Ferocitas the Dream Eater, has been wearing a necklace that glows green in the night. Now, seeing my Dreamcatcher, I am sure that he has stolen my emerald. He would never realize that its power is useless to him. Find this missing jewel, adventurer. And while you're there, clear out some of the corrupted mystics as well. After the Battle of Mount Hyjal, we were without direction. Nordressel smoked from the fire it unleashed, and our immortality, the very essence of our beings, was lost. 
It was in this trying time that the betrayer was freed from his prison and Shando's storm rage disappeared. A dark time for all. There is another moon well southeast of the entrance to Darnassus on the shores of the pools of Arlithrian. The Sentinels are having problems patrolling the area because of attacks and the growing ill-temperedness of the Gnarlpeen Furbogs. Be wary as you seek out the well and keep your weapons close at hand. Always remember what I have shown you today, adventurer. You are part of the balance that the Night Elves strive to keep intact, even during troublesome times. I remember these enemies is very hard. And they root you also sometimes. We're in combat. That is a huge crit, 28. Goodness. Not enough energy. How may I Ah, it's here. I have waited for this rare earth for quite some time. I hope it's still fresh. Thank you for bringing it to me, adventurer. You are a traveler who is generous with her time. The timberlings of Teldrassil are elementals of nature. In some ways, they reflect the natural order of plants and animals on our great tree. So it is disturbing to see how angry the timberlings have become. I believe it has something to do with the soil. I've been working on different methods of nurturing plants and would like to try them on timberling seeds. Please, can you gather seeds from timberlings around Lake Alameth and bring them to me? Sure thing, buddy. All timberlings are sprouting around the waters of Lake Alameth. I'm afraid these sprouts are beyond help. We should try to clear them from the land before they grow large enough to cause trouble. When you're wandering the lake, if you see any timberling sprouts, please take them. Help keep our land clean. Would have started taking them sooner if the game allowed me to. But no, I gotta get the quest first. see our macro do we see an icon there we go pickpocket stop attack pickpocket stop attack cheap shot so we need to get cheap shot first and then we can actually start using that Will be sold by vendor. It's pretty cool that it shows that. Level requirement is seven, so we're still on par with what the quest says we should do. I 
I don't think we should just kill them. Uh, we should remain where the icons is displayed. So we can loot as well. Looks like a pretty nice mace. Not enough energy. Honestly, can't believe that food in the classic. Like in this game. Uh, I think the buff only lasts like two minutes. actually lost one we need. Two more of these guys. One more. This quest is done, though. But I honestly think we're like speed running at the moment. Like, we're going through this quest like really quick. With almost no breaks in between. Work complete. Falcon. I think this guy has animations. What brings you? Here? You got them. This is good. I will plant these seeds in special soil I have prepared. I believe the seeds will sprout into timberlings who are much more docile. Perhaps later you can see the results. Adventurer, can you take one of the seeds you brought me to my friend, Relian Greenspire? He is a druid in Darnassus, and when last we spoke, he revealed his interest in my work with the Timberlings. He had some ideas himself, and he will appreciate a specimen seed to work with. Thank you, Adventurer. You have been a great help to me. I hope that someday you will see the fruit of my labors. You will usually find Relian walking the pathways of the Cenarian Enclave in Darnassus. That's a lot. I'm afraid they're spreading at a dangerous rate. I hope I can solve the riddle of what is tainting them. Thank you for your help, adventurer. The land is a cleaner place from your efforts. No problem, buddy. Now open your wallet and give me all your money. Everything. First aid. 
They're saying they forgot to <laughs> to learn first aid. Oh snap! We have a quest all the way out there. We have ten slots available, so we can actually still go there. What the heck? <laughs> Narpine Mystic. So this game has a lot of running around in it. At least uh, until level 20, which I don't think I'll be able to afford amount. Wait, 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 this is classic, right? So it's, isn't it 40? Man, another reason to be a hunter. Because I think they get movement speed at level, level 20. Aspect of the Cheetah, if I'm not mistaken. There's a hunter here. It's the same guy, like he's still here. do it together. I mean, I don't really want to do it together. Not energy. I'm out of range. I need to target something first. Not ready. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. Thanks. We might need a buff here. It's a 15 minute buff. Stamina increase. I think we want to pull it a little bit back. We got the necklace. Dude. It's only this guy that drops us. It is too far away. I can't do that yet. I'm not ready yet. I can't do that yet. You need to use the item. to use the item. What item though? I 
can't carry any more of those. My ability isn't ready yet. Not ready yet. I don't have enough energy. Human Orc Knight Elf Undead. Why is it showing that? I'm clicking. Bro, what the heck? Narpine misc misc. I can't carry any more of those. Narpine misc. I just need these guys. We just need to kill the shamans and we're fine. This guy tricked me, dude. He made me think I had to do something, but that's not the case. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. Become a skinner or miner, actually. Make some make some monies. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Where's my first aid? Oh wait, I I haven't made yet. Let's just make one.
I'm pretty sure I can't get that one to come out. I don't think we have kick yet also. That's what I'm talking about. Another quest well done. Get out of your bunny. four slots available. We're level eight now. Goodness. Takes a long time to level, dude. I don't even think we're gonna reach level 10 within part one. We need to fill the veil, but it's all the way down there. <clears throat> level nine quest. <clears throat> Goodness. Making my way downtown, running fast. We haven't got an upgrade in a in a minute, that's for sure. Hopefully we get an upgrade or two by handing handing in these quests. Hopefully. I'm listening. Now I can repair my dream catcher. Thank you, adventurer. No problem, buddy. Ah. Show me them nips. That's the only hand and quest we have here. I feel like we should sell more. Hey, we have a potion. What uh, level requirement is this? Level 7. So most probably we'll go do that quest then. So this exclamation mark we have here is... It's three dudes on a mount walking up and down on, on this path. Well, if that's the case... We'll go this way. Uh, maybe down there is where the cave is. No, no. It's this way. 
shows it on the map. Another add-on we can get. So we can actually zoom in on this map here. We still don't have interrupt, right? We have gouge. Gouge is somewhat of an interrupt. See, harder enemies, we actually need to use gouge. There's a few uh, cool ways to actually use it. So what you'll do is... Like, right now I'm low on energy, you gouge, and then you wait until your energy is higher. Well, not 100%, but... Um, I don't think we can go that way. Yeah, these two are way too close to each other. This one turned around. again. I can't do that Might be a, a rare here or something. I think it's the other side, dude. Like, we're running to the rare, if there is one. It's the other side. Maybe the other way. Let's do it. Clearly not an upgrade. Thank you. 
not enough energy. It shows it here. I don't see him. Shut it. Work complete. Wow. <laughs> Not ready. That ability isn't ready yet. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. I can't do that yet. I don't have enough energy. But we survived all the matters. That that was pretty scary. To think that this is like a level seven quest, dude.
<تصفيق> يعني <وط. تصفيق> I just had to ask if he's the real guy, but it clearly is not. He's a fake. Peace. With Lord Melena's laid to rest, I can finally move on to other matters. Thank you, adventurer. We still have no green item. Feel free to browse. Uh, we can check if we can upgrade. Like a cat dragged in from the rain, you scratch and claw, then do it all over again. I'll be back for more. Oh, I didn't see you enter, adventurer. What can I do for you? Thank you for help, bro. Okay, all quests on this side is done. Requires level 7 and 8. So this is the quest giver. Assemble. In position. There we go. The road to Darnassus must be kept safe. Travelers heading from Dolinar to Darnassus have been reporting ruthless attacks by corrupted fur bogs from the Gnarlpine tribe. Important news and commerce travels to and from Darnassus by way of this road daily. We cannot afford to have a rogue band of heathens terrorizing people. Take up arms in the name of the Sacred Forest Adventurer. Their den lies somewhere below this vantage point. Slay six of these Gnarlpine ambushers and report back to me. Only six. We also have our other quest here. Claw Talisman. Requires level 9. I don't have enough energy. But we do have evade. We do have some potions also. Getting a tiger's eye. Not enough energy. Dude, that's a seventy two crit. Got a better belt. Well, that's the only belt we have. Not enough energy. Work complete. Shouldn't I go in there?
Ravenclaw, dude, it's inside this cave. Yeah, there's no way I'm going there right now. I think we'll get another quest that will lead us in there, if I'm not mistaken. Wait, it is the quest, dude. It is the quest. How the heck do they want us to do this? I can I can see this go extremely bad. They're standing so close to each other. I think this is... This is an area where we should go to once we have deal wield. Because I can see this go extremely bad and it's just game over. And it says requires level 9. We're still level 8. Well, we're almost level 9. Think we should be here yet. I, I'm so scared, dude. I mean, 1v1, and we're like half health. shouldn't be here. Well, let's do this. You know what would make things easier also? If I just run back and... Use gold. You know, buy some upgrades. Buy better armor. That can also work.
What was that ping noise? I hope it's not a rare. Oh, we could also use a scroll of protection. Hmm. That can also work. Uh, let's do it. Getting an armor buff for 30 minutes. Is there three of them in one room? And it's a room we have to go into. Yeah, we pulled both. I'm out of range. My ability isn't ready yet. I need to get closer. I don't have enough energy. I can't do that yet. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Shut the fuck up, girl. Resting. We have a chest here. How do we get this chest without fighting both? Both is coming.
We got trash in the chest, dude. Have we checked the other side yet? Because there might be something on this side also. There's two again. Both is coming. Let's get the healer then first. This just feels like it's not okay. Like how hard this is. I also most probably just have to get a food buff, man. There's no need not to. Let's get a food buff. We have only two slots available. One copper. This level 9 one looks like it's roaming. Um, we can't use swords yet. We need to go train it. Oh wow, physical damage done reduced by 3. Got cursed. Need to be very careful here. That level nine one can actually sense us from the bottom. Dude, both of them is level nine. There's no way, right? I don't 
have enough energy. Let's just have to use evasion here. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. Not enough energy. I need a target. Why is it so difficult? The gnarl pine shaman that inhabit this place have discovered a way of separating a sleeping druid spirit from the physical body. The furbolg have animated my physical form and are using it to attack anyone that attempts to explore the Banathil Barrow Den. I am now trapped in the Emerald Dream, powerless to stop this. You must help me. The Gnarlpine Shaman carry a strange charm which is used to perform this ritual, and I'd like to examine it. Please, adventurer, bring one to me. Not enough energy. I don't have enough energy. God damn it. I think the one we're looking for is all the way down there. And then I don't know what this is. Shaman Voodoo Charm. the guy that will curse you. Yeah, there's the curse. Uh, we don't have a quest for him. Oh my goodness, bro. There's no way... Asking which quest? So we can't we can't get this one yet because the level ten is a damage dealer, the level nine is a healer. I I can't go there. We can do the rest of the place though, I think. Feels like we're still cursed. I 
I should have never entered this cave. That's not good. I'm out of Oof, those damage we're doing. Come on, nice. Shaman Voodoo Charm. Oh my goodness, bro. This one's walking down. We should fight him here. Actually, I'm scared about this roaming humanoid. He's level 10 also. Can we sneak past them to get our loot? Level 8 and 9. Oh, we got past. Ooh, dude. Insane. She. Okay. We'll fight this one. Not enough energy. Got cursed again. Upgrade there. Oh, my goodness, there's two of them. We do have our evasion again. There's only two, yeah, there's only two. I can't do that yet. I 
There goes our last potion. Yeah, we'll have to come back here at a later stage. Unfortunately, right now we can't finish this area. So I think we'll just hearth and then we'll call it there. The videos are actually pretty long indeed. Two hours, 18 minutes. Of pretty much just struggling, let's be honest here. Um, clear this inventory. Dude, we got so much cloth. Feel free to browse. See, I think we, if we bought this weapon, it would have been so much better. Hello. Look at that upgrade, dude. Good luck, friend. Like a cat dragged in from the rain, you scratch and claw, then do it all over again. I'll be back for more. I didn't see you enter, adventurer. 23 silver. You. Some big upgrades. How may I help? Goddess, watch over you. Farewell. Yeah, if we had this before, Voila. we would it would have been good, I think. But uh, we don't, we didn't. Good luck. Friend. All righty then, guys. I think we're going to end it here. Hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and I'll catch you beautiful people in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.